<laughs> Jesus Christ, made you feel me falling off the edge. What up guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Lloyd Purvis and this is Run For Adventure. We are bringing you another running kit review today, but it is definitely a running kit review with a difference. So we've come out to sunny Hale in Cornwall. We are hooking up with the TNT crew tonight. TNT crew is a group of like-minded runners who love running on the trails of Cornwall. If you follow the channel, you know that we have recently hooked up with CL Athletics and they've been kind enough to send us a load of their running caps down. We've got their best-selling go caps, all the way through to their new TRL caps and TRL visors to review at the channel. I'm a massive fan of the brand, so I thought it would be very biased if it was just my opinion on them products, having worn their caps for years and really getting on with them. I think they're personally the best caps in the business. So this is why we're hooking up with the TNT crew because we're gonna get other people's opinions on the products. I've come up with an ingenious way of how to give out the hats to the runners to review. And what we've come up with is... Uh, <laughs> the CL and Run For Adventure Lucky Dip box. So the box is loaded with caps. We're gonna get the guys over, they're gonna stick their hand into the box, pull out a cap at random, and that is the cap that they're gonna be wearing for the majority of the run. We'll get their opinions on it while we're running, and then at the end, we'll get a little review from each guy on each hat. Some of the guys love a running hat. Other guys are massive fans of the CL brand and some of the runners never wear a hat. So we'll get a real good broad spectrum of opinions on the running hats, but let's get these hats handed out and let's hook up with the crew. Right, so we got the box ready and here's the crew, a fine specimen of athletes. Look at them, <laughs> raring to go. So Joe's up first. He's gonna put his hand in the box. He's gonna have a rummage and he's gonna pick out a hat at random and that's the hat he's gonna run in. So Joe, up you come, mate. Ladies first. No looking in the hole. It's got to be random. What we got? What, what we, got? we got? Oh, let's yes. have a look. Let's have a look. Okay, nice. Nice and colourful. And that is a go cap. One of CL's top sellers. Have you ever worn CL caps before, Joe? Never. 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 Looking forward to this. He's Looking a CL cap it. virgin, so this is going to be a good one. Right, you're, that's you done, mate. That's your cap for the run. Thank you very much. Nice one. Uh, I tell you what, it matches your eyes. You look beautiful. <laughs> yeah, I'll go up next. Oh, right, Tristan. Right, Tristan's next. Tristan is a bit of a fanboy of the brand. So, um, let's see what cap he pulls out. No looking. No, wait, wait. Oh, oh. No looking, it's got to be random. They're all good, but you want a good one. Have a good rummage. Good rummage. Oh, uh, this one. Oh, we got another go cap. Nice. Right, nice, new colorway. Feeling that, Fresh that's for the nice. season. Happy with that one, yeah, mate? Yeah, that's wicked, that's wicked. Awesome, mate. Eyes closed, have a good rummage. That's the way to do it. Yeah, what do we got, what do we got? Oh, hey, look at that. Nice, nice white. That's a new TRL cap. That's new, that is. Fresh for the season, yes. <laughs> hey? How's it feel on? Yeah, nice, nice, comfy? Yeah, comfy. Awesome, so have you ever run in the brand before? No. It's gonna be a good one, this. We like, we like virgins to the brand. It will give us a good, honest opinion of their running hat. Awesome, mate. Right, mate, so Richie likes a running hat, as you can see. I never wear a hat. Oh, okay. Never wear a hat. Visor? <laughs> right, in you go, mate. Eyes closed, don't look in the hole. That's it, good rummage. What do we got, what do we got? Oh, it's looking colorful. Look at that, eh? That's a beauty. But that is fresh for the season, a new colorway. Look at that. Oh, you can adjust it, you can adjust it. You've got adjustment, mate, look. I have got the world's biggest head. Yeah, biggest head. Oh, you'll be all right. All right, mate. I'm on it. Yeah, awesome, mate. So you've not worn the brand before? No, ne never, never. Awesome. Cap wearer, like a running hat? Yes, yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah. cool. Let's see what you get, mate. Into the box, no looking. What's he gonna pull out? Oh, he's having a good rummage. Oh, hey, he's got a visor, one of the new TRL visors. Look at that. He's color coordinated. Beautiful. 
Matches your eyes, Scotty. That's lovely. Feels nice. Feels good. Mm. Right, last but not least is me. So I've got to pick a cap out. So let's get a good delve in the box. Last cap. Oh, no spoiler. wow, awesome. No spoiler. ALZ cap, a new cap from uh, CL. Funny that I picked that hat when it's my favourite. We're all ready to go. I've got my cap on as well. But yeah, we're going to do six, yeah, seven miles, yeah, nice and steady, nothing crazy. Wow. Try and get some awesome food. It's a beautiful evening. We're going out into the Towns of Hell. It's an awesome place to run. So let's get running. I'm rocking the ALZ cap from Versiel. Uh, it's a new cap to their range, very similar to the Go cap that I've worn for years and years and I love. A bit more stripped back, slightly smaller brim, which I love. I haven't taken it off my head since I've had it. So we are off the dreaded tarmac and we are just about to pop out on the Towns. So lucky to have so amazing trails on our doorstep. On an evening like this, it don't get a lot better. We got our in house photographer, Will. Yeah, he is yeah, face in the sand. TNT photographer, <laughs> official. And we got a few, a bit of new blood with us. Well. We got Jamie running with us today. Jamie is a speed freak. Well, it's a quick run. I should call him a freak. <laughs> uh, they are fresh back from the Welsh mountains. Uh, hopefully, their legs are heavier and they'll run a bit slower. But the other day, Jamie thought um, he'd go out and try and break his marathon PB all on his own, not running in a race on his own. And tell the viewers what you ran, Jamie. Two hours, 36 minutes, 46 seconds, which I was very happy with. And a PB by how many minutes? Uh, about 15 or 16 or something like that. So that's the kind yeah. of caliber of running. That's on his own. No pacers, no V formation, no bouncy springy shoes, none of that. On his own. And it just so happens that Will, our official photographer, made an awesome little film about um, his experience and pulling off that PB. Will, name of the film. Project Airfield. Project Airfield, how can people watch it? On uh, YouTube, on Run, Eat, Repeat, or either Jamie Yorkshire Runner on Instagram, it's in his bio and my bio. Awesome. Runs on the awesome, and I'll, I'll leave a link in the description, so definitely worth checking out. One, a great little film and an amazing achievement by this man. So, yeah, link in the description, check it out, well worth a watch. Definitely got some cracking weather for testing out running hats. Beautiful summer's evening. We were going to film it last week, but the weather was rubbish, so we hung on for a week and we got out this week in this glorious, glorious sunshine. Amazing. What a place to run. What do you reckon so far, Joe, about the hat, mate? It's awesome. Yeah? So, yeah, I love it. It's, uh... And you are a hat wearer, aren't you? I am for many years now on the trails, you know. And what would you I've normally wear hat wise? I've got the buffs, you know, and I've been happy with those okay. over the years. You're, right, you're running the buff? Yeah, and... Um... <laughs> <laughs> hey! Hey! I'm here all week! Hey! Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's great, it's a great fit. Cool. You know, I'm really pleased with it, you know. First and, time uh, in the brand? Yeah, first time ever. Awesome, so it's fantastic. Man. I see that Ron Hill hat's looking a bit tatty there to me. I... Fine, I'll leave a link in the description, mate, for uh, CL. Yeah. If you want to buy yourself a new hat, it yeah. might be worth treating yourself. I can't yeah. spare one at home. <laughs> All folded up, ready to go. <laughs> it made you more efficient, that hat, mate? Oh, yes, of course, yeah. Lloyd. Yeah. Half a minute, a mile quicker now. Proven, these caps, they make you run quicker. That's a fact, isn't it, John? That's a fact. Yeah, fact. It's a big thumbs up. Yeah. Obviously, that's not a fact. Don't oh. sue me if you buy a CL hat and it doesn't make you run any John, quicker. How are you finding that visor, Scotty? Cool. Yeah. yeah, very good. 
Yeah. Very comfortable. <laughs> it's it's just by chance because it was complete, yeah, you, you know, totally random, yeah, yeah, lucky dip. The, main, the main guy track. who's got hair got the visor. So you've got miles and miles of trails out on the Towans. We've run out here for years. We know it like the back of our hands and we're not lost on it. Even though we're going through brambles. <laughs> Who let the new guy lead? Just a little bit of off-piste action. But we're, uh, we're back on the trails now. Look at that view. How mega is that? Such a great place to come run and train. I love it. Been on the beautiful Towns for three or four miles and now we drop down to the beautiful three mile stretch of golden sand. Look at that. So Luke, you're rocking the TRL hat, a new hat from uh, yeah. CR. What do you think, mate? Yeah. How's it feeling? It's good. It uh, keeps the sun off my little uh, pool patch. Okay, that's good. That's always good. Nice. Yeah. Well, I've, I've had forward facing for like a blinker. See where I'm going in the sun. Yeah. Rear facing for ventilation. Oh, rocking yeah. that trucker hat, mate. But currently I'm going to do it for forward facing. And first impressions, first time you've worn it, what do you reckon? Yeah, good. Yeah, comfy? Right. Yeah. Fits well? Yeah. Stays on your head? Yeah. All the important stuff. That's right. And it's not reflecting the brim. Okay. What more could you want from a hat? So for a non-hat wearer, you, you feel it's all right? Yeah. Yeah. We're getting lots of thumbs up tonight, that's for sure. I think it's going to be a positive outcome. The downside of dropping down to the beach is we've got to go up this sodden sand dune to get off it. And it is a beast. This is why it's a good place to train. Super soft sand. Super hard work. Gets the old legs burning. Lungs burning. Makes you strong. You're on camera, you can't you can't walk when you're on camera. That's policy. Come on Luke. No walking on camera. It's a running group mate, come on. Running group. Enjoying having this camera put in your face at this moment, John? Well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's it, go on mate, go on, you wanted to run then. Well done. Good effort. Feel that burn, mate. That is the session done. We're coming off the Towns, heading back to the hard stuff, the tarmac. Did just shy of seven miles seems to be pretty positive when it comes to the caps everybody's had positive feedback first time wearing them guys that have never been in the brand before and loving it really comfortable really well fitted really breathable so super positive but we'll get back to the van and we'll have a short little review from each runner and just see how they felt running in the seal athletics caps let's get back to the van so joe Put you on the spot. Let's get this. Let's get the. Let's get the light right. Ah, oh, that's better. Beautiful. We've got your best side as well. There you go. Right. Sum up how you felt about running in the CL hat for the first time. No pressure. In one sentence. Yeah. Pleasantly surprised. I really enjoyed it. It was a good hat. The fit was fantastic. Um, sweat was great. You know, I didn't have any beads of sweat in my eyes. So it's and wicking well. Everything else was wicking really well. And uh, yeah, I recommend it highly. We uh, we always like to score things at Run for Venture. So what would uh, out of ten? What would you give it? And be honest. Be I'll be honest. honest. I'll give it. I'll give it a nine. Give it a nine. Big thumbs up. Yeah, with a nine. it's perfect. On on the spot, a bit of pressure. Yeah. How did you feel running in the TRL visor for the first time? Very very comfortable. 
Very comfortable. It's very light. Yeah. Very comfy. Yeah. And it feels feels like quality. Yeah. Yeah. So you're happy with it? Yeah, very happy. Awesome. And we always like to score stuff at Run for Adventure. So out of ten, what do you reckon? Nine. Nine. Another coming in with another strong nine. Nine's all round so far. Yeah. He doesn't really run in hats that often. Not running. But hats. he likes a trucker hat. Yeah, so right, yeah, he yeah. definitely picked out the right hat. Yeah. So in the new TRL hat from CL, what do you reckon, mate? Yeah, it's good. Kept, yeah. my, kept me cool, kept the sun out of my eyes. I've, mold, I've like modified yeah, shaped, the peak the frame. during the run. It started yeah. off like this. And, uh, yeah, but it fits well. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice and breathable. Yeah. Nice bit of ventilation. Yeah, yeah. And the hats use Reprieve, which is recyclable out of um, plastic bottles. So that's always good, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Comfortable, practical, <laughs> run well, and doing well for the environment. We always score stuff at Run for Venture. Yep. So again, out of 10, mate, what do you reckon? Yeah, nine. That's nine? Yeah. We've got nines all around. And um, I mean, I'm a bit biased because I love the brand, so I, I can't go 10, but I, I would give it a strong nine as well. So thumbs up all round. And I tell you what, boys, for doing doing such a, doing such a good job. Everybody who had a hat, had a, had a hat. Come in here, come in here, come in here. Have we got everybody? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, one, I just want to say a massive thanks to CL for sending, sending the caps down to review and obviously a big thanks to TNT for running the caps and helping out. Because they helped out, you can all keep your hats. Yeah! yeah. I thought they'd like that. They're all really tight, they wouldn't have bought any. But... <laughs> Cheers boys! <laughs> well, that was a success. The caps went down really well with the lads. I think it was a really good way and an unbiased way of reviewing the product, but it's late, I'm starving, let's go home and have some dinner. Well, that was awesome fun, that's for sure. I've managed to get some dinner, so I've got some calories back in, so I'm raring to go. What a spectacular evening we had, hooking up with the TNT crew and filming the CL Athletics running cap review. We got some great feedback from the guys and we'll definitely be doing some more reviews that way in the future. And I also hope you enjoyed seeing another amazing place I get to do my trail running here down in Cornwall. But I suppose this is a kit review after all, so let's give you a quick conclusion when it comes to the CL Athletics athletics caps and visors that we've been testing. First of all, I've been super impressed with all the caps and visors that we've been testing at the channel. I've been a massive fan of the CL Athletics Go Cap for years, but it's great to see the Canadian brand branching out and bringing new products into their range. The TRL caps and visors, they're also producing a super cool looking performance bucket hat at the moment and some pretty smart looking technical running t-shirts. To see all that knowledge CL have gained over the years producing performance running caps going into other products is brilliant and I'm sure we're going to see their product range grow even more over the coming years. When it comes to all the caps and visors that we've been testing, the standout caps for me have to be the very much loved Go Cap that I've worn for years but I've also really enjoyed running in the ALZ cap, a cap I hadn't run in before, but I've really, really enjoyed it. Both models of cap have a lot in common. They are both constructed using the very breathable, fast drying, cool wick performance mesh fabric, super lightweight, very, very fitted. I personally feel the sign of a great running hat is you should be out there running in it, it should be doing its job, but you shouldn't necessarily feel you're wearing it. And I got that feeling in both these models and it's what I look for in my running caps. Both the models are super, super soft in construction, so it's very easy to compress down, fold up and stuff in a pocket or stow away in your running pack. So it makes the caps super practical. Also, I think it's great that CL Athletics are starting to use Reprieve. If you don't know what Reprieve is, it is the world's number one brand when it comes to recycled performance fabric and it's being used in a lot of the products across the CL Athletics range. And last but not least, we have to mention design. Um, I think you'd have to agree with me, the caps look pretty damn cool, that's for sure. You can tell there's been a lot of attention and care gone into the design and the looks of all their caps, visors, bucket hats and t-shirts across the range. But I suppose if I had to pick one cap, I would have to go for the ALZ cap. You know, it's a cap I haven't worn before. I love the fact that all the great features from the Go cap have been carried over to it, but it's been a little bit more stripped back. So it's a little bit lighter, a bit more breathable. Again, the brim is a bit smaller, so it's a bit more compact. Um, it's become my go-to cap. I've been wearing it for most of my runs. 
I'll definitely be investing in a few more of them in different colorways to add to my already extensive cap collection. So if you're in the marketplace for a performance running cap, I personally wouldn't look any further than CL Athletics. Top quality, super performing, very cool looking. If you brought a cap, you probably wouldn't have to buy another cap. It would last you a lifetime. Well, that is until obviously next season's awesome cool colorways come out and you just need to have one. But that is a wrap on another kit review at Run For Adventure. Really hope you enjoyed the review and you found it useful. If you did, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We've left links in the description if you wanna find out any more information about this super cool brand from Canada or you wanna have a look at any of their other products within their range, please click that link and do so. It would be awesome to hear your feedback. Have you run in the brand? How did you find it? Have you tried any of their new bucket hats or t-shirts? Get them comments down below. But for now, that's it guys. We will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching and stay safe and keep on running.